Oh yeah, wait, I can change my clothing. Actually, did they maybe add more clothing? What do you think? They, they, they I think they said something about that actually, didn't they? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Maybe we have to go into the buying menu, right? Yes. Uh, let me quickly go into there. We we'll have a shop, there we go. They Open. did great things. Ooh, that's beautiful looking, and ooh, that's also beautiful looking. Oh, bro, ain't even ready. I, oh, bro, that's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Give me that, and... <laughs> bro, ain't ready. Uh, I, ha I haven't ch changed yet, give me a second. <laughs> bro, Yo! stop watching me change. <laughs> Did you change your gloves, Yo! too? Should have. Maybe it didn't, it didn't register, alright, there we go. Am I completely changed, too? Yeah, you are. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> We've done it, the gaming Yo. squad. Dude. But dude, look at this. What? My guy got shot, he got blasted. Oh hell no, wait, is it actually dirty behind that? Oh yeah, it still is. Employee entrance. Imagine walking in here. <laughs> yeah. Actually... This is so weird that the elves have like a doggy door and Santa Claus gets the entire door for himself. I mean, do you think that the elves could push open the entire door? I think that would be a bit, you know, You, you don't know that. I for think, some weaker elves. I think they're all strong guys and girls. And non-binary pals. Should we maybe first walk around before we clean everything? Yeah, you know oh, what, I, I agree with you. Yes, is this a bomb? Me. Oh no, this is probably a Christmas ornament. Never mind. You know the post of the Paw Patrol uh, advent calendar and the mom is like, I can't believe they put symbols of guns and grenades in my Paw Patrol calendar for my son. Watch out, parents. And then it's like a Christmas ornament and a upside down... Uh, <laughs> shoe for like skating. Ice skating shoe, right? Oh, I. I mean, yeah. people are sometimes smart. What can I say? Oh, that looks interesting. Nice. Wait. Nice. There's a uh, picture behind that. A map. Oh, I see. That's a reference. A great job, buddy. I'm proud of you. Thank you. It's a Wii Sports reference, for the people who didn't get it. There's light coming in from somewhere. Maybe up above is like a window? Maybe. I don't think there's a window. Maybe the, ma maybe the map is new, we can forgive the developers. Look at Santa's sleigh and it is poisoned and stuff. I mean, thing is, I'd also rather have more light that isn't there than no light and have to clean in the dark little man and big man is there a little man door here mm, i think that's just santa's office they don't need to go in there oh a poster is here that we can't see yet uh where oh there's another Ooh. there's another guy that got blown to pieces yo but this time with purple instead of pink yeah you know, this map uh, reminds me a lot of the Viscera cleanup detail Christmas map. <laughs> Why is it also like that? There I mean, there's like... I mean, you know, there were also elves that were... That, that had to get cleaned explosion. up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we should someone play Viscera cleanup together, I think. That would be so much fun. I actually never really played it that much because I didn't have any friends to play with. I don't even own the game. I just like the idea of cleaning things. I think we're ready to start cleaning. Yeah, probably. I so see what I'll the poster. clean this mantle that you have started on. Just oh, to be Christmas evil. party! Join us for a Christmas party. Christmas Eve Sunday tonight. 6 p.m. The snow globe. Music, food, and drink. Please note, after last year's eggnog issue, we are no longer providing eggnog. As a 
beverage of choice. All right. Hype. Let's just not ask. Maybe this was the Agno no, Incident 2.0. I will ask. And no, it was not. It could have been the Eggnog Incident number one, though. What if they just didn't clean it up for a year? And they just worked in this beautiful place. I mean, maybe. I mean, it. they were like, yeah, it's gonna get dirty again anyway, so why clean it in the first place? Which I kind of get that mentality, you know? If your room was so dirty that if you just touched anything, you were, you would have to take a shower or you get some kind of disease, then I would probably clean it. You know? Nah, you know, I think it gets dirty anyways again, so why bother? Do you think Santa and the elves can get a disease? <laughs> like, could they... Could they I have a like, question, do you think Santa and the elves can perish? I mean, thing is, Santa doesn't really have the the healthiest diet, you know? You don't know that. He eats like millions of calories in cookies and milk every year. I mean, in yeah. One night. But he People also moves at the speed of light. Damn. Yeah. I mean, when Santa... Santa d dies from a heart attack or something. True. I mean, maybe? I mean, we don't really know. Why is there not enough Santa lore about... T t <laughs> if, he, if he can perish and stuff, you know? True. Did you, by the way, watch a video about Santa? Like, not being healthy and dying and stuff? No. I thought you were. I thought you had that conversation because of a video I watched recently. Oh no, I was About just thinking that myself. Damn. Yeah, that yeah. was an interesting comedy skit by Ryan George. Is that the guy that does? Is that the, the guy that does? The, the, it's barely an inconvenience guy. Yes. Oh. But like that's his. Ryan George is his other channel that isn't, you know, about movies, but about his own little things that he makes comedy sketches about. Yeah, his own silly little thoughts. Yeah, that have nothing to do with movies, usually. Damn. That is crazy. It do be sometimes. Oh, uh, by the way, did you know, Dave? I did, yes. Uh, Dirt Blasters has basically caught up. <gasps> oh, hi. Yeah, I think I have no Dirt Blasters left, so... Hello, people that are right now probably celebrating Christmas or New Year. One of the two, maybe. Or people who listen to this after the time. Woohoo. Because this is... This might be our last Dirt Blaster stave. I mean, you know that there will be updates to this game. I mean, yeah, but like the last one that is actually coming out weekly, you know, with consistency. Ooh, we could we, we, we could make more episodes. <laughs> you are not wrong about that. I mean, we, we don't have any games we need to play. There's it some games that recently released that we could play, but you know. Yeah, we should definitely Power play Wash. Little Company eventually. Yeah, true. Especially with mods, it could be fun. Yeah, but I think first we should experience the game without mods, just to know what it's like. Yeah. And then when we have Hatsune Miku murdering us with the Minecraft pickaxe, because as everyone knows, Hatsune Miku created Minecraft. I think that's a well-known fact nowadays. Uh, also, I was thinking Left for Dead might be fun. Uh, one or two. Left for Dead too. Oh, all the, right. The game that has that's known for having a lot of mods. 
Yeah, I have already dabbled a bit in those as well myself. <laughs> because I've played all of Left 4 Dead 2 myself, so yeah. I never did, actually. Yeah, I played as Hatsune Miku with my friends that were Mario, uh, Peach, and I think... A, a custom character named Greg, if I remember right. Damn, you gotta love Greg. Yeah. Whoever made Greg, shoutouts to you. Or maybe the name wasn't Greg, but you get the spirit. If if you were that person, thank you very much. Oh, true man. Yeah. Ah, uh, I love mods. I don't Imagine understand. If they made... What? Imagine they made mods for Power Wash. Oh, that would be so cool. Awesome Honestly, there might be. Yeah, but like officially supported mods with like... Yeah, Steam Workshop integration and stuff. Yeah, that would make it... I don't like having to download mods, you know, online. Yeah, but I guess if we did it for Lethal Company, we would have to do it online, sadly. Alright, didn't know that. Yeah, but there's some pretty well-known sites that do it, so it's kind of safe at least. I mean, that's... I mean, if a game is big enough, then yeah, that's usually gonna be the case. Yeah. Uh, I just don't understand how some companies don't like mods. I like, mean, I can understand if it's online games. You know, uh, like, GTA had a lot of problems with hackers and stuff. Yeah, but that's hacks. Hacks are not mods, I, in my I mean, opinion. I mean, yeah, but thing is, like, a lot of... Like, I, for example, there's, like, this program called Wiimod. Yeah. Basically, it's just a... a trainer for different games, so, like, you can use cheats in every kind of game. Yeah. But, like, it, it's not made for online use. So if mm -hmm. you just want to have fun in a single-player game like GTA and just... Use cheats without like the time limits and stuff. Yeah, that's kind of nice. Yeah, true. That could be fun. And GTA had like a lot of trainers for it. <laughs> yeah, there were like five different ones, and I always managed to not install them correctly, and only like one of all of them worked. Hi. <laughs> I was uh, bad with computers. I was like 12, which you should not play GTA when you're 12. No, but I I've, didn't play online. Honestly, I feel like GTA 12 is like the target demographic. Thing is, yeah, I guess. Eh. Uh, Thing is, target demographic usually are never accurate. Yeah, true. I mean, all of the <laughs> games that act like, ooh, we are so adult, we are so grown up, you can shoot with guns in our game. Like Call of Duty and all of those. They act like they want to have their audience at like 18, 16, somewhere around that. But I feel yeah. like only kids play those sorts of games, mostly. And then you have Animal Crossing and like the most manly men of all men. Oh, Animal Crossing is so good, though. It is. I don't know why, but designing a home is so fulfilling. Well, I was thinking about actually buying House Flipper 2. Yeah, I, I think I'm thinking about buying House Flipper 1. <laughs> Sadly, they don't have multiplayer in those games. Yeah. Imagine, like, we could stream, like, a multiplayer House Flipper. Oh, that would be banger, not gonna lie. Oh man. But also I can see why they're not adding multiplayer, because, you know, kind of a pain to add that. I mean, yeah, but it would also, like, be worth it for them, probably. I mean, every mul 
every game that has like multiplayer immediately increases its, its like longevity by like twofold or something. I mean, yeah, maybe it will come because like this is the second game in the series. Yeah, so I it's think, clearly successful. Yeah, I think they probably will add it. But we'll have to wait and knows. see. I haven't actually seen like any statements made by them. I didn't look into it at all. Yeah, I only now heard from you that it even exists. Oh yeah, I saw it because, you know, a small streamer made uh -huh. a stream about it. The streamer is, is called Ch Cherma. Oh, hype. Yeah, a little tournament in the game. Damn. Wait, was that the one where he was... Uh, had a Barbie house or what? That was the first game. Oh, and they, right. like, when the second game launched, they got early access and so they could train for it. Like, a yeah. three days early. At least some of them did. And uh -huh. then... And now they have, like... They made another tournament as soon as it launched. Alright, a uh, naughty list. There's, I found Santa's list oh, on the I, I got a quickie, it raised my name. Uh, you don't look at this name. Wait, why are people crossed out? Uh, is that because they were naughty or is that because they... I think naughty list means you get written on here if you... I mean naughty oh, and wait. nice. Oh, no, I see. Yeah. Naughty, nice. So they were on the nice list in the nigga cross. Or they were killed. Who is Booster or whatever that name up there is? I feel like... Uh, oh, he's probably the best kid because he stars. Yeah, but... The nicest. Who is that? Is that a reference or something? Don't know. I feel like these are maybe developer names? Nah, this is Krampus. We know who Krampus is. Oh, the Grinch! Yeah, I, I think some of them are references and maybe some of them are developers. Yo, Krampus, that's like a reference to the Ice Isaac. Yo, Isaac reference. Bully. Yo, that's from the hit game Bully from Rockstar Games. Yo, Lump, that's like a reference to Lump of Coal from Isaac. The original one, yeah. Uh, do we have any other? Coffee bean! <laughs> That's a nice reference. True. <laughs> bang bang. That, that's Funny. a reference to Garden Yo, of it's Bun Neo Bun. Fro from, it's, in wait, they're teasing a, a, a collab, look, a Neo. They're that teasing a collab, so trust me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> they teased the collab right here. <laughs> Imagine, man. Wait. We need that, so we need the pool rep. We need the pool collab. Actually, imagine cleaning 100 acre woods. That could be kind of fire. Ruby, yo, that's a reference to uh, uh, <laughs> that, that anime, Oshinoko. Totally uh, a reference, trust me. I, I thought you were talking about the anime called Ruby. Oh no, that's di written differently. I mean, yeah, but she's called Ruby. Written like Ruby. I don't know, I didn't watch it. Damn, imagine being bad at watching. I can't watch every show that exists. Then you should try to be better. Ever thought about that? True. True. Waste your time with mid-shows. Instead of watching only the good ones. Oh man. Yeah, true. I'm gonna now immediately rewatch the entirety of My Hero Academia. <laughs> Yo, that's an absolute banger. That's such uh, a mid show. I wish we could just go to an anime event again and just scream Deku at everything. That was. So funny. <laughs> it's funny every year, man. What can I say? <laughs> Honestly, that's so true. 
And the best part about it, every year it gets funnier. Did we ever talk about that on stream, by the way? I don't know, we can't talk about it on this stream, I guess. <laughs> yeah, um, so you want to tell the story of <laughs> our anime events? <laughs> sure. So we, we went to those conventions. It's like a place for people who like games or cartoons or anime go to. M mostly games and anime. Yeah. And Star Wars. And D&D, they also have the D&D section, I guess. Oh yeah, true. Yeah, and cosplay, they love cosplaying, obviously. Yeah. But anyway, we go there and we, we, we like some stuff, so we walk around, buy some plushies, some funny Kirby <laughs> merchandise or whatever. Yeah, a, a bread dog then, every year. And it became a meme that we just say everything that was Korean is Deku. <laughs> I mean, in the beginning, it was only things that were like green hair that were Deku. I mean, yeah, and like, you know, then we see like a choker and we were like, oh my god, it's Deku. <laughs> Like one of yeah. the best Joker cosplays, and we're just like, yo, it's Deku, no way. <laughs> yeah. I think my favorite one we, uh, or I think I did, was when I saw a green stormtrooper Boba Fett, and I just called him Deku. Oh, no, nah, man. <laughs> yeah. We and, have and <laughs> done that a lot. And basically, uh, the last year when we went there, we actually got some official Deku merchandise. <laughs> True. I, I, there was like uh, those mystery bags, right? Yeah. And you could have a, some kind of, there was like, they promised one Funko Pop in there and Person not a fan of Funko Pops, but I was hoping for a Deku. <laughs> <laughs> and and I got a banger, I got All Might, but in his weak form. <laughs> it oh, wasn't Deku, yeah. sadly. Yeah, but and at least the right something. series. Yeah, didn't yeah. I get like Teen Titans, whatever it was called, and one of their villains? Could be. I don't yeah. know, you got a Deku in some yeah. place. <laughs> For another mystery thing. <laughs> yeah, that was the second. That, but that was specifically in my hero box, I guess. But it had like yeah, fifteen, I think, different characters that could be in it. Yeah. And I got the and special got version of Deku this... carrying the kid. Yeah, little uh, the girl of the horn. <laughs> yeah. Harry, I think. I don't know what she's called, I never watched that far. I know, you watched like two seasons. <laughs> I watched one season and the first episode of the second one. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, the animation in the tournament arc was pretty fire. I don't know. The story know. in the tournament arc didn't really need a good story, so you know. Yeah, I was just mostly bored and the first and start of the second season, so I just dropped it. I'm not gonna lie, I s it was my second anime that I... Except for, like, the ones I watched as a small child. Ooh, Pokemon and Digimon. And Kirby. Oh yeah, Kirby. Right back at you. That's such a banger. Yeah. And basically, I liked it because I, I also liked online that I watched before it. <laughs> yeah. And like I that's and you know then I was introduced to actually good stories. I was never a big like movie watcher. Mm. Like the only movies I watched were like Iron Man. Damn, I'm so sorry for you. And I I still think they're good, but like I mean, they're you not know, bad. they weren't like, they weren't like great stories or anything. It was more like, cool movies. Yeah, the story was alright. 
Yeah, I mean, that's also how most movies are nowadays. They're not good, they're not bad, they're just alright. Well, as long as it's not a Disney animated movies. Alright, those just... Do we know if Wish is actually, like, computer, like, AI made, or...? We don't, but, like, I... Like, when a villain is literally just, like... I I do those evil things so that something doesn't happen. I do what them for a certain, reason. What is that certain something? We tease it with an image that can be revealed later. Oh wait, we forgot to reveal it. Oh well. Maybe they had hopes that it would be like big enough to make a second part. I am sorry, but like. The, the villain was defeated at the end. Yeah, but maybe like his mom is mad now and avenges him and then you see, oh, that's what they were trying to... Or, yeah, he's defeated and now it can come back, whatever happened last time. You know, yeah. and then it's like, in retrospect, he was right. I mean, thing is like, he stole people's wishes, right? Yeah. And like, if he steals some, so, like someone's wish would be like, uh, wanting to become a, a rock star or something. Yeah. And if when he, in this kingdom, when you turn eighteen, your wishes are taken away by the king. Damn. And basically, you completely forget what your wish was, and like, uh -huh. no one in the entire movie really cares that their wish is gone because you know they don't know what their wish is yeah and like then this girl wants to become his apprentice yeah she wishes for it no she like goes oh. to a job interview and oh. then like they talk for five minutes and then he is like and like i think then it's explained that every year or whatever they he grants one person that he took the wish from their wish. Damn. So if you're lucky, your wish may be granted. I mean, like, so you could maybe become a superstar without you know having to try. I guess. Yeah, that would be kind of cool at least. And then he they go like to the, then like after they talk for five minutes, so the king just matter for five minutes he's like come I, sh I will show you the room where I keep all the wishes uh -huh. all right here is my super secret room where all the wishes are at I will never grant these wishes to everyone after five minutes he's yeah he's like yeah I, I trust you to show you a secret room with all the wishes in it uh -huh. and then she is like damn I'm gonna tell my grandpa who had his wish stolen then the grandpa's like how dare you reveal the king's secret wish stash to us damn yeah she's the evil i i can see that I, they, they just wanted some family tension i guess i don't know <laughs> then she runs off into the woods and fi finds a little star thing it's good merchandise i guess I mean, it's like the minions. It probably. looks like a. Uh, no, it looks a lot like a Luma. Yeah, I know, but like, maybe they're going for the same kind of charm. You've seen it once in a movie, so now you'll want it. I guess. Minions were better, though. And then they like had a little. 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 was it? A donkey, I don't remember. I think a little donkey, and like, they gave the donkey a voice. The star, and then it's Yo, like, Shrek. aha, the donkey has a voice, and it's like a baby donkey, but like it has a deep voice. Yeah, that, that's funny because you expected it to have a uh, not <laughs> high deep pitched. Voice. Yeah, yeah. So it's like kind of funny. Damn, I wish I could write for Disney just to make all of them see how uncreative they are, and then flex on them and leave again. And basically, oh, the funny thing is, 
how do you think they defeat the villain that like has wishes in his that is stealing wishes and stuff uh... do you think they like trick him into to granting a wish and the wish is like that everybody gets their wishes back or something no i th i think the stupidest way would be if they like wish that the the evil guy just would not have the power anymore you know that's 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 actually better than what they did <laughs> wait <laughs> what did they do? She, she, she sang. She sang? Yes. And then he was like, alright, I heard your voice. You know what, I'm gonna be good now, or... I don't know. It, I haven't watched it, you know, I just watched reviews. Ah, alright. And they said it was bad. <laughs> uh, and, and also, like, he gets... At the start, he isn't really that evil, but, like, he opens a book, and then, like, there's evil green magic things that float around, and he they go into his hand or something. Is this the, the Tears of the Kingdom, but, like, the green is bad? I don't know. It, it They said, like, that the villain just... Feels like he just changes personality from scene to scene a bit. You know, something that would probably happen when an AI writes a story. Yeah. Man. And like the the villain is evil because he's evil. Like they forget that they probably even teased it, and that's something an AI will probably forget. I mean, yeah, you're not wrong. Uh, and funny thing is, I was like, hmm, I'm gonna ask ChatGPT to write a, a movie called Wish. Uh -huh. I just wanted to know what ChatGPT would spit out. And how similar was it, just by random coincidence? So, I mean, I mean, it's definitely gonna be different because you know, even ChatGPT would write it differently. Yeah. But basically, it was like in a in a medieval fantasy kingdom there's a girl and she has a wish and to grant her wish she goes into a magical forest that's mm -hmm. about the gist of the story that I got hi but then you were too lazy and didn't read on yeah <laughs> but I mean basically that was kind of the same thing it also had like a king in the story I read that much alright and the king was the evil guy who did not grant the wish, or what? Uh, no, he just had a bad wish. Ah. Maybe that's the prequel! Yo, or maybe the king didn't want to grant the wish because his wish was evil and then he was like, damn, I gotta take my wish away. And now I gotta steal everyone else's wish. Damn, I it, I wouldn't trust myself with these powers, why should I trust anyone else? So true. <laughs> yeah. I also love that I was like the anniversary movies for 100 years. An <laughs> entire century of Disney and they're like, let's make a movie that's like not good. Yeah, I mean, isn't that just uh, Disney nowadays all the time? Ooh. Also, like, she has a couple of friends, and you want to know what their personalities are? Uh, sure. One is sad. That's, that's his personality. Damn. One of them is a little happy, I guess. Mm-hmm. One of them is, like, sneezes a lot. Uh-huh. And I think one is, like, a little sleepy. Yo, we love Drowsy, the, 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 one of the seven gnomes. Or not gnomes, one I of the seven dwarves. guys. Dwarves, that's what they're called. I think they wanted to go, like, for the seven dwarves, but they were, like, they had less personality than the seven dwarves. 
Somehow. And like, you do mm. both are in this show for having a good personality. Yeah. They're more like supporting. Yeah. Or not, not even actually. I, I mean, they are supporting. And they do have some personality, they, they really like her. I mean, they also do other stuff. Yeah. I think the Seven Dwarfs, at least in the original story, already have a lot of personality. Well, I get excited for when, 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 the, re when the live action remake comes out. Uh, well, didn't they dwarfs. cancel that? Oh uh, wait, they did? I think they did. Oh, that would be nice. Yeah. Because I heard like they cast only actors that aren't dwarves, but like from every other minority. Yeah. I, Which I, was a bit of a weird decision. I just think it's weird like Hollywood, let's be real, doesn't really give any jobs to people that are like like that. So why can't they just at least give the jobs that, like, exist to them? Or yeah. If they at least, like, wrote more stories to include them, which you don't have to write specific stories. You can just throw those actors in anywhere. They're just, you know, normal like everyone else. I don't get it so much, man. Yeah, you don't need, uh, like, to have an explanation. It doesn't even need to be a big character. Yeah, I mean... What's the guy called that played Tyrion Lannister in, like, Game of Thrones? I uh, don't know. He's, he's an incredible actor. Yeah, that. Yeah, but he's in a lot of shows nowadays, even. Or also movies. Uh, I wish I knew his name right now, because I know I usually know his name, but I just can't think of it right now. But he's, like, a really great actor. I love that guy. Alright. Yeah, shout outs to whoever that person is. Did you watch Game of Thrones then? Uh, I didn't watch it, my sister watched it and I made fun of it when it got bad because she watched it over like... Uh, f uh, what's it called? Over... Duh, 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 duh. The time so you couldn't times? leave the house. No, oh. like when it was. Oh, dinner, every no, dinner. No, like oh, when I got home from school but had to go back to school after. What's it called again? Oh, uh, lunch. Yeah, lunch. That was way too hard to figure out for myself. Uh, but yeah, every time I came home for lunch, she just watched that, and then I made fun of it every time. And then it actually got bad, and then I got even more reason to make fun of it. Isn't it like that, like, the first three seasons are pretty mid, and then, like, it gets good for, like, two seasons, and then, like, the last few seasons are bad again? Oh, no, uh, the first uh, four seasons are incredible. Then the fifth season is kind of meh. Then the sixth season is a banger. And then the last two seasons just are horrible. Alright. Yeah, so the, theoretically they did a good job for most of the show, but... They I mean, only the ending did... is kind of important. <laughs> yeah, first of that, second of all the parts of the show that they did well was with the help of the real creator of the show, like the one who wrote the books. Yeah. And he helped them until season 4, I think. And that's why season 5 was such a dip in quality. But I think he told them, like, uh, what he wants to do still with the characters, which was why season 6 was so good. Because they basically used all the big things he wanted to do and then just put them in there without thinking about it, but at least it has, like, big set pieces which made people hyped. Yeah. Uh, and then in the end they just rushed the story completely because they got a uh, deal signed with Star Wars, I think, so they could make the next Star Wars movie. Oh, and, and instead of pausing it, they just rushed it. Yeah, 
I mean, not even pausing it. They could have just ended it normally and then just made another Star Wars show or something. But yeah, they just rushed it. And because their uh, show got such a poor reception at the end, uh, Disney actually deleted their contract. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> yeah, and as far as I've heard, they didn't get a job since, but that was like a couple of, maybe two years ago, so they might have gotten another job nowadays, but don't know about that. And maybe I've also been misinformed back then, because I did not honestly care that much. Honestly, I just know that there's like a lot of those big TV shows that like everyone knows that I haven't watched. Yeah, but most of them just suck at the end. I mean, there's... What's it? Walking Dead? That exists? That's oh yeah, that one. sucks. I, I think it gets, like, good in, like, season four or something, but the first few are, like, alright. I watched one season, actually, of that. Yeah, I heard that the first two seasons suck, I think, or are, like, mid... Then it gets kind of good, but I heard that the ending also sucks. I mean, I just know that it's like the, the first season, it was alright. It was very generic, I guess. But maybe for its time it was kind of good, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it was the first big budget um, zombie movie, I guess. Or and not was movie also series. Like, and there was also like the Stranger Things that I watched one season of yeah because my friend was like damn i want you to watch stranger things it's really good it's so strange and, and i'm like yeah i don't really care for those with real humans in it i like cartoons because it's funny damn and then he was like damn i'll 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 watch one of those anime if you watched Stranger Things, and then I was like, damn, sure, I guess. Dang. And then you were and a I big him... fan. I watched one season, so you know. <laughs> and that means you're a bad. big fan. I just, I just, I just didn't feel like watching more. Yeah. Understandable. I didn't like a lot of the characters and the romance, I did not like that at all. Because it was teen romance and... Yeah, almost know. makes you feel weird to watch it. It's not even like I was a teen at the time. Ah. Uh. It's more like just teen romances are so much, so bad sometimes. Because it's like, oh my god, look at Jared, he's so good looking. And then like the less popular guy who is like really hot but like the movie pretends he isn't hot and then like the female character is like oh damn he actually is kind of hot and like the other girls are like damn. what are you talking about and then they start dating or something and then it's like wow crazy yeah and then they gotta include like a, a naughty scene in there because Wait, who doesn't like to see I mean, somewhat. I think they're already 18, at least I hope. I I don't think it the first... I, I, I don't remember, alright, I... I mean, uh, you know what happened in the book, it, you know? What did? Well, you don't know. I don't know, man. Basically, the author wanted to show that all, like, five kids were uh -huh. mature after their adventure yeah in the book. so they all five of them uh, did things together all five all five together no way I don't know if it was five that's like a big it's a it's it's uh, they apparently did i never read it and i, I don't know if I, I want to i feel like that sounds fake i've heard it like multiple times now i think that's fake maybe it's just a rumor that the internet came up with and everyone believes it 
I think that's the most likely thing because I, I don't think that's what happens. I yeah, but anyway, sure. I just don't like. I just don't like teen romances. Yeah, same. Oh well. It depends, honestly. Though there's some good ones, but like the only good ones I know are like Avatar. I mean, yeah, there's also some like anime that have good romance, but they're like more chill. Not like that. The harem ones or whatever it is. Oh yeah, those are the most horrible mov uh, shows for that. But like, the, there's like Planet, for example. That's like beautiful. Yeah, that's actually just depressing, man. <laughs> yeah, but it's like, it's so well made. It's like actual romance, not just, oh, look, girl, hot. Now we have yeah. hot girl. Yeah. And that's why I like girl, because girl kind of cute, no? Yeah, though, the thing is with Clannad, I also don't like how it, 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 he has like several wannabe love interests, honestly, I, mean, I kind of dislike that, that part. I mean, that's because it's a uh, visual, visual novel, novel and it, yeah. you could go with all routes, I guess. Yeah. But so I... And I mean, like, in the end, when he, like, gets together with one of the girls, then it's, like, actually... Yeah. It doesn't, like, switch. There's no drama, like, oh, yeah, he that's actually kind of likes this girl. I, I don't like that kind of drama. Yeah, same. That's good, at least, about it, but I still think they could have just done it better if they just focused only on their romance and not also on... Ooh, that 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 all the other girls that they are also there. I think they just wanted to be accurate to the source material. Yeah, but I think it would have benefited the story if they weren't. If I, I can mean, be that's, honest, that's for sure the case. But like, I didn't never felt like, like any big romantic tension between the other characters so much. Yeah, but... Uh, yeah, I guess. It true. just had, like, a lot of episodes that focused on them, because, like, something was happening in the story with them. Yeah. Like, when there's, like, a girl and, like, something happened to someone that she knows, like, in her family or something, and then they had an arc around her. Mm hmm. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. The best character in all of Clannad is the pig, anyways. Not the dad. No, the pig. I mean, it's a pretty good character, but the dad is so good too, man. No, who cares about the dad? Who's dad? There are so many dads in that show. At least two. Who actually? Yeah. Technically three, actually. Wait, this who's is the third dad? I know the main characters and hers. Yeah, and the main character. All oh, right, I forgot about that. You're so right, man. Everyone should go watch Clannad right now. Just. But like, yeah, her dad. It's pretty amazing. Yeah, I heard that is fun. But the the pig, the pig of the other girl, that was that's it is a, a pretty based fun character. Pig. Yeah, that is he's, a pretty based character. He's just goofy. He ramps people like and does not care. Actually, there's another anime that had a pig, and I did not like that pig. Oh, I which anime? Seven Deadly Sins. Seven Deadly Sins had a pig. Yeah. It even had multiple pigs. It had a big pig and a small pig. And they rode on the big pig. Like the entire tavern was on the big pig. I don't remember that at all. And there was a small pig. Like he was... 
helping at the place where they worked, I guess. He was like the sidekick at the start of the show. All before right. any of the seven deadly sins were introduced except for the main character. I mean, he's not a sin, right? Ha 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 ha. Yeah, he totally is, and... Yeah, Honestly, and he does not he get too powerful way too quick. I mean, the thing is, it's like fun. He, the story isn't about like his growth, it's more like about something else, I guess. <laughs> I still I don't know what that story's about, not gonna lie, so I couldn't tell I mean, you. It's like a, such a good story. Yeah. At the start. I mean, it's at an alright story at the start, and it keeps getting worse and worse. It has a... Bon. Bon is a really great character. Is that the guy that it can't die, or what? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, Such he's cool. And I he like has the him. best romance in the show. We, I... we don't talk about the, the age. I don't even remember there being a romance with him, but sure, I believe you. I think every character has some kind of romance arc, and every romance arc is a little messed up. Yeah. Not in universe, but like for for the viewers. I don't know, I just don't like that show that much. I liked it. But like the animation also got really bad towards the end. Yeah. You probably saw the memes. I actually did not, but I also really don't care about animation quality often. Yeah, Dude. but like when it's so bad that you actually can't watch the show anymore. You know. Yeah, then it sucks, but don't know. Wouldn't know since, you know. You haven't watched it. Again. Yeah. Haven't picked up the second season. Oh, not even the second season. Yeah, is there more than the second season? <laughs> the second season was still good. Oh no, there's the four seasons, I think. Oh. And like I'm season so three sorry is where it's for the people. Season three is where it started becoming problematic. Like there was like the biggest hype up fight between. Uh -huh. Uh, Meliodas, the main character, yeah. and the uh, sun guy. Wait, why do they fight? Uh, Meliodas becomes evil because his... Oh, because I of his, his power. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. And basically, there is a fan animation out there which is ten times better. Oh. Uh -huh. Because the animation quality was literally like Meliodas does a kick and then they just draw one frame of his kick and like he flies across the screen in that one frame. Damn. Or like that one position. That yeah, that's is and odd. And then there are like three frames of of the sun guy hitting him, but like he was in a cloud, so you basically just saw him swinging his axe into the cloud. Uh. And they like repeated that frame for like 10 seconds basically, and that was the fight. Damn. Basically. It was, it was horrible. That seems really odd, not gonna lie. Did, like, yeah, all I... of their team quit or something, or why was it that I... bad? I have no idea how they managed uh -huh. to mess it up that badly. Yeah, that almost seems impressive, not gonna lie. Yeah, I mean, I've seen animes with worse animation, but still. I mean, I have seen the worst anime in general, but still, that's not something you want to be compared to if, if you don't Is have that to the... be. Is that the one where every, like, where, like, the animation is, like, 
like 0 0.1 frame per second or something? Uh, actually never heard of that even, but maybe, could be, I don't know. Like there's, there's an anime and they were like, they just didn't draw a lot of frames, so you have like a crowd of people running. And like for a 10 second clip they basically just showed 3 separate images. Uh -huh. Of them running. Damn. I might have to find it and show you sometime. It's actually not, it's actually horrible. Yeah, I know one of the worst animes in my opinion that I've watched is an anime where like a fart... Like a guy just oh. farts and then... I know. It, yeah, his fart just teaches him life lessons. I, uh, yeah, I have not watched it, but I know what which one you mean. Yeah, I watched it, and it's not good. <laughs> Were you just curious, or did you want to, or did you know it was bad? Uh, I was curious because I seen people rated like a seven out of ten, and then I was like, "All right, odd concept, but seven isn't that bad." <laughs> <laughs> All and, right. And then I watched it, and then I was like, "Yeah, this is definitely a one out of ten for me, man." Other than that show, only like One Piece got that rating from me so far. Oh damn! Yeah, not a big One Piece fan, I guess. Thing is, I usually wouldn't give it a one out of ten because it's it's not that bad. It probably deserved like a five out of ten. Yeah, that's. Seems fair enough. Yeah, but... Maybe even a six. Maybe even a six. Yeah, but the community just annoys me so much. And it is truly just not a good... Sh like, don't get me wrong. It's a good show in terms of, like, story and plot. Because, you know, if you got ten years to make an anime, eventually you'll find one good story beat. But... It's just not worth it to get there in the first place. Uh, I think it is like, it has a lot of great arcs, right? Like, I recently got to the uh, Enos Lobby arc, and like, yeah, that one's basically, good. basically, all arcs after Enos Lobby are relatively good to extremely good. Yeah, they're. That's All basically right, like two hundred. Basically, it's like two hundred episodes of pretty good content. Just some are a bit stretched out. Yeah, the thing is, I don't know. I just feel but like then, <laughs> One Piece is too long for its own good. Yeah, I, I that that could be. I mean, it's hard to get into, especially. I think if you watched it from the start and grew up with it. That's like amazing to you because you like saw how the characters evolved, yeah. and mostly how how Nami, the uh, body changed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, it's not a big change or anything, you know. Yeah. You almost don't notice it. Uh, yeah, who who would honestly notice it? I don't even know what you're talking about. Yeah, why would you know? Yeah, and all of the female characters other than Nami in the show definitely don't have, like, the exact same thing. Well, there's like... There's like Big Mom, I think she looks different. True, I guess. But only slightly. <laughs> Honestly, what I love about the show, it's just how silly the, some characters look. Yeah. Like the character designs are sometimes really creative and stupid. Yeah. But it's not a show you can't like take seriously and be like, oh yeah. Good story and stuff. And, and like characters with cool designs, not really. Yeah. Fun designs, not cool. Fun. Yeah, it's more a silly, goofy show, I guess, true. Yeah, if you go ahead, like, if you watch it with that mindset, it's great, but if you're expecting, like, 
I don't know. Eight tier storytelling. Like, or something like Naruto even, like that's... The shows, I feel like often get compared, but they're like so different. <laughs> no, I think Naruto is similar enough. True. Eh, it's Both also just... Suck. What? Both shows suck. I mean, in a way yes, in a way not. I mean, thing is with both I shows just mainly. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're not wrong in a sense, but it's also like you know. I feel like the best thing about both of those shows is definitely the animation. Not for one. Piece. When One Piece has some really great animation, but like fights, yeah. they don't know how to do that. Yeah, but I'd still say about both shows, their best part is the animation. <laughs> Damn. I mean, Naruto had some banger animation, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I like that one from the movie with Boruto, where he just cries. That's not from the movie. Isn't that I've, from I've, the movie? No, that's from the series. That that's actually oh. a filler episode, even. Oh, the, this actually damn. no wait. That cry. It depends on which crying you mean. If you mean the scream the one of we pain mean. after his. Uh, yeah, I, I think, think the scream think of pain. One, if it was a scream of pain because someone broke his arm or like leg, I don't remember. Uh. Then that was a canon arc. And if it was like crying because his friend died then it's filler arc uh, which I didn't even know his friend was a filler character because he was introduced relatively early damn and he was like the friend was like supposed to be the next uh, Misu Kage like the water Kage guys uh huh and then like there's like a whole story about his friend that he was like in an evil group. Damn. And, but he was like actually not that evil and then he turns to the good side and stuff like that. Alright. Sounds and like a they have... good story. Yeah, it was alright. I mean, it was filler, but you know. Yeah, but could at least be alright. <laughs> and then there's like... And then they made the pirate arc where he was in it again and then like they have fought extremely powerful people and like all of them can use pretty powerful truths and stuff and then they die to a, a guy who is balding and has never heard of you know taking care of your body and stuff have and you he heard of manscape <laughs> The thing is, like, the, it was, he had, he was, he, he was just, like, the most uninteresting guy. He was just, like, a, a random bandit that exists. Damn. Basically, like, one of the strongest characters in the show died to a bandit because the bandit made a pillar of water and hid inside of it. And... They couldn't get him out of the pillar of water because they didn't use lightning stuff. And then a fight later, they use lightning stuff and are like, wow, it works. Damn. After one of our friends has died. Lightning beats water? What? What? Crazy. That is so I was crazy. Like, I didn't care about the character dying, I was just annoyed that... That they that's how he died. They were just not smart. Like, I didn't care for any of the characters. I was just like, at least make a good make story, it make man. Sense. Yeah, the characters are. Yeah. Like, Borto is, like, supposed to be the child prodigy. Like, he's smart. And yeah. then he's, like, completely stupid just because the plot demands it. I mean, isn't the other person, Sarada, also very smart? I mean, she has glasses. Yeah, also she she has... She's like, uh, you know, she has 
a the he has some lightning jutsu. Yeah, and she has the huhiha. Yeah. Honestly, I, I I haven't read the manga anymore for a while now. Like since the time skip happened. Oh, you don't want to get spoiled for the anime? No, I want to re I wanted to read it, but I just couldn't. Oh wow. Uh, the outside does not look good. Oh. A for gore floor. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised that they did not think we could jump. I mean, you can even walk. Yeah, you can well, you jump. jump one. Yeah, it's not hard. It's like, I think everyone is going to look out here because, you know. Yeah. I mean, if they already present you with something to look at, then it's kind of Like the rough. game is known for that. I can see why they probably forgot it, because I feel like this might have been rushed a bit, because they wanted to get it out before Christmas, maybe. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I it's also like, don't take away their points, but, you know. It's still a great sad. game, I mean. And they're yeah. also working on the Warhammer thing, still they confirmed recently. <laughs> I'm, I hope that will be a banger. I mean, I mean, they've been working on it for so long. Yeah, the things I don't care about Warhammer. Thing is, if I remember some of the set pieces right in Warhammer, it could at least be, like, cool. I mean, I'm excited at. for it. Yeah. Because I get to clean more things. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I don't, I don't get why they don't Warhammer. just add uh, simple stuff, like, give me anything to clean and I'll be happy. I think it takes just a while for them to make maps that are, like, good. Like, they want to make... I mean, like, having openable doors, that's such a banger. Yeah. Oh, man. Also, I like... Uh, I don't think I've actually told chat yet, but I'm recently really obsessed with another game. Ooh. Is it the one it's you made yourself? No, oh. it's it's Club Penguin. Oh, yeah, you didn't say that yet. You only told me today as well. <laughs> I mean, I got obsessed like yesterday. Hi. But basically, imagine if you could clean those places. Uh, thing is, who do you even ask at this point with like Club Penguin being closed and all that? Disney, I guess. Do Disney own Club Penguin? Yeah, they they bought it in 2007, I believe, or 2008, and the oh. game was like released a year prior. All right, it was didn't so know successful, that. and that's why like the game could have so many updates and stuff. They had, like weekly updates. Oh wow! Yeah, it was it was crazy, honestly. Yeah, I never knew they, about that. They basically do the same thing like that, like uh, Fortnite does, with like constantly adding new content and stuff mm -hmm. to keep people invested. But like, you know, they have a different game, I guess. True. Which and works really well. And I hope they make another Club Penguin-like game, man. I mean, they have uh, Toontown, I guess. Now, isn't that also Disney? It's, I don't know what that even is. I gotta look into that. Uh, it's like, basically, you could, uh, like, do different things. I know there's, like, a turn-based uh, fighting game in it uh, and stuff, but you could also, like, have your own house and stuff, which you could design. And your characters are like all animal, furry-like creatures. Alright, oh, I'll look into it, I guess. Yeah. I just know about it because one YouTuber I watched made like three Let's Plays of it. Alright. Yeah. The biggest thing is like, I, I like... I like that it had like so many updates and so much charm to it. Yeah, true. But I guess I'm also a bit too old for it now. 
You can never be too old for clubbing the penguins. Actually, that sounds wrong. Yeah, it kind of does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yo, they wanna go club some penguins. Hell yeah, dude. Oh man, Peter's after us once again. Oh man. I hate when this happens on Saturdays. Yeah, I mean Peter is after everyone for some reason. And then eh. they like accidentally have another accident where like 15 pandas die because they're stupid. Yeah, thing is pandas dying is so understandable though. I mean, yeah, but like it, it, it happens too much to Peter somehow. Yeah. Did they like not recently, but someone like rescue dogs from some houses and then like the dogs died because they like didn't transport them correctly. Uh, or like got hurt. I thought they put them down on purpose because they were like hurt or something. But I don't remember. I don't, I don't know. I'm, it, uh, yeah, I'm just not a big fan of that company, man. Yeah, same. But I'm also not a fan of many companies. <laughs> uh, I mean, wait, give me two seconds. I'm All a big right. fan of a certain company, though, of the, the company called Future Lab. That's a great company. Yo, I also love... Uh, where do you see their thing? Is it in the menu? No, it's not. Uh, isn't Future Lab the people who make Power Wash? Yeah, it is. Where did you see their logo? I went to, I went, I went to Steam. Oh, I, had, I had hopes I could show it on stream, but uh, yeah, I, I am also can. a big fan of Future Labs. Let's hit, uh, hey, Future Labs, hit the dirt blasters up for a collab anytime. <laughs> We're down. <laughs> Wait. Imagine they collabed, man. The, on the world map, there's a lot of areas that are like grayed out. Oh, wow. What does the grayed uh, out mean? You uh, want to stand up here with me? Yeah. Oh man. Uh, but they, they, they for out. What do you mean grayed out? Like there's like lines through the, some places, like in the middle of that place, or like in in oh. the middle of South America, and on the corners of each place, basically. Uh, that probably indicates the mountains, I would be guessing. The thing is, there's like mountain symbols here. Yeah, also there would be a mountain straight down here. Because that's the Ural uh, Mountains. I know that. Because I feel like it may be... Is it like places he delivers to? Uh, that would make sense here because there's like a lot of America that isn't in though. Yeah. It's like the main area. Or what if it's like all the naughty people and we just have so many naughty people that is <laughs> taking over the world. No one is getting presents <sighs> this year. All of Maybe. Sweden, Norway, Norway and Finland just does not get presents. Maybe those people here on the naughty and nice list, maybe the nice people are the only nice people in the entire world. Damn. But then wouldn't like the, the naughty, naughty list be longer because it does not have these two lines here, so... Oh Actually, no, naughty I don't is think like, so. maybe the especially naughty where he like, doesn't just not give them present, but he like, I don't know, kills their parents or something. Damn, bro. <laughs> Why, why, why would Santa do that? Why, why Slim Shady do that? Why Slim Shady do that? <laughs> Man, I'm so mad that I saw that review. <laughs> it's too good. It is really good. <laughs> oh man, I I want to one day be a reviewer. Map. 
and just write such bangers. Yeah. Why Slim Shady do that? <laughs> Why Slim Shady do that? Why he an evil big guy? Oh man. I oh, love Slim Shady when he do that. Man, me when Slim Shady just do that. What was it about again, the video where that was said? Uh, it wasn't even a video, it was just a thing, it was just a comment on the, 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 the IMDB page, I think, or somewhere, of the New Hunger Games movie. Oh yeah, the, right, New Hunger Games. Yeah, the even hungrier that's, games. That's where there's a slim shady guy. The Hunger yeah. Games that totally wasn't a cash grab. I mean... The, <laughs> Thing is, you're not wrong, but you're also not entirely right, funnily enough. Did they not make money off the movie? Uh, no, because of a different reason. I hope they made money off of that, but I wouldn't know. What, why then? Uh, because of a reason which uh, is kind of the reason why I want to make a video about it, which is why I'm not uh, saying it right now. Um, I gotta wait for the video, but it's still dirty. Let's focus on dirty. I'm not even sure if I'll ever make that video, not gonna lie, because I am... Christmas tree present! Y'all, because I am just now reading all of the books, or rather listening to the audiobooks of them. Christmas tree uh, present still. Uh, this one... Hype. Uh, but... You didn't do the first balcony buster. Ah, I am searching balcony for it. Balcony buster found it. Found it. Damn. Well, on this side, I'm guessing. Yeah. No, bro got to it first. How could he? Uh, machine papers. Decoration machine papers. Oh, do you wow. go for that one? Then I'll go for decoration machine vent pipes. Oh, these two are still oh. empty. I cleaned them. I'm bad at cleaning them, I guess. Yeah, it happens. Uh Yeah that one I I actually I think I Whoa eh uh, dude Dude <laughs> Get good scrub I I I can see the outside <laughs> Can you go outside? No I don't wanna fall There's the dude. floor here <laughs> What well. Oh you're okay, back. I got... Hello How did that happen? <laughs> you pushed me to the wall <laughs> Can you push me around a bit, man? I'll try. I don't know how I did it. Like, I walked into the corner here. Like, I All looked right. at the corner here, like at this pipe. And I went like, eat it. Like, ooh, look at the pipe. And, stuff. and you were like here, trying to clean the pipe from all angles, I guess. Yeah. Is it clean, by the way? Oh, it's clean. Yeah. Weird. Oh, the wall, the wall isn't clean yet. Oh, yeah. Oh well, that not even sense. sure where there's still dirt on this wall. This side maybe? No, you can't really see back there. Uh, oh, there. Need some. Oh, is it down here? Yeah, it's down here as well. Ooh. I gotta go eat by the way after this. Yeah, same. That's also why I'm kind of trying to hurry, but also heavily failing, apparently. This quarter wall just does not like being clean. Oh, is it behind these things? I see some, yeah. There's some. Yeah, oh, let's all go. Right. Still a lot more to clean, I guess. I go all the way to the... Wow, there's a lot. Entrance Jeez. handle door. Workshop present one of these then guess oh, I get in them did I no. small bastard Why I thought I just Santa's boot 
Roto Long. Uh, Can you give me two seconds? I'll be back soon. Uh, sure. Entrance store hinges. Oh. Got it. What else we got? Fireplace cover. Oh, up there. That's gotta be I'm one back. of the spots. Yeah, welcome back. Wait. Do you also Small. love to jump and clean stuff that you can't even really see? Yeah. There we go. Podcast. What's the wall be? Present. Oh, I found it. Oh. I found the one. Bro, found them for real, for real. I think there should be one oh, more. This one. Oh, that one. Yay, alright. Bro, really cleaned it. Fast as a brick. Uh, giant Wait, bobble tops? What are bobble tops? Oh no, I'm done. I'm stupid. We haven't. Oh wait, you wait. Oh, I'm stupid. All right, now I get it. Why? Uh, it's lazy. Do you know what giant bubble tops are? Nope. All right. No idea. It's lazy. Uh, man. Bubble this tops. one somewhere. Dirt. Please be gone. Be gone, dirt. Giant bobble, giant bobble tops. The ornaments are called baubles, apparently. Oh yeah, I heard that actually before them being I called baubles. Did not. It's like I think that's is that British or is that normal? I don't know. <laughs> I may <made> not. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is that British or is that normal? That's so based, man. <laughs> I didn't mean to say it like that. No, no, you're right. You're right. I agree with you, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> you're either British or you're normal. <laughs> oh, man. Why you do that to me? Uh, what is grotto skirting? Oh. That's a good question. Santa's boots, they're not clean. Uh, oh. Stocking. Where? I guess they're clean now, alright. I didn't even spray. What is Processing grotto machine. skirting? I have no idea. Curtain. Oh, that's dirty. Grotto wall panelings. Which wall panel could it be? What is All a right, wall panel? Worked. Nice. Wait, what? Res present collection box presents. Uh, present collection box presents. Oh, present collection box presents. These. Wow. Was that the last one? No. There were All multiple. Right. I think. I'll just quickly do the oh, lanterns. I, I think. Oh, this one. I think is still lighting up. Lighting up, I saw you. Oh. Getting lit. Bro is so lit like nobody was before him. Lantern. I think lantern. that was all of them. Nutcracker hats. I did not think their hat would be a part of that we have to clean. Yeah, same. Not even going to lie. Grotto wall, paneling, oh. grotto skirting, and lanterns. Yeah, I, I should have the lantern. lantern soon. 
Now what's the skirting? Actually, do I have the lantern soon? Oh, that's the last lantern. Uh, that's also what I was asking. And what are panelings? I'm gonna I'm gonna select ones that shows me one of them. I'll click on panelings. So and then see. I'll go for skirtings, I guess. Oh wait. Yeah. Oh, you found I it? found the skirting or paneling. I found, I the, found the skirting. I found the panels. The panels are right above the skirtings. Just oh. don't know which one. All right. Uh, uh back here is some more paneling. This oh, I found it. No. Oh, nice. Should be this, maybe at a lower angle. You're right. Let's go! We, we did, did it. it! We saved the cities, Patrick. Alright, with your time. Woo! Oh, wait. Now it's complete. Thanks, game. Yo! Give me your time. Yo, we're dancing. True, that's what I call cleaning as well. I feel like you did so much more. I feel like we both did the same amount, but I don't know. I feel like you did like all the floors and walls and ceiling. And yeah. I did like all the small machinery and stuff. Yeah, but those are more intricate details, so yeah. But I anyways, guess. chat. Is Pin. there another map? Just want to know. Uh, no, there is not. Or I don't think... Yeah, there is not. Alright. Then, chat. Thank you for watching Dirt Blasters and supporting us throughout this year or whatever it's been. Actually, probably like half a year. Yeah. Uh, my... Yeah. It's barely visible on this glass. Thank you so yeah. much. Alright, bye, bye bye. Goodbye, people of the internet. Have a nice see you Christmas. Christmas. True, see you in see you Christmas. In new future times <laughs> when more content come. True, see you in 2024 with other things and stuff. Bye bye! Bye! -bye.